you guys, Samara Rivera here. I'm at Escuelita today, Monday night, with the diva, Ms. Larissa Daman. How's it going, honey? Great, how is it going? Thank you for coming down. I have a whole, quite a few talent tonight at the Idolize Me contest, Star Search. So tell us what is, is this gonna be a new, it's a new thing and it's gonna be on every Monday night? Every Monday night, whoever out there who has talent, if you can sing from recording artists, I mean, up in future, uh, female impersonators, male dancers, anything that will make you win $100. Towards the end of the year, we have 52 contestants, then we have to narrow them down and online to 12 idols, Idolize Me contest. Oh, fabulous. And tell us about the fabulous DJ that's one of my favorite DJ. Mine's too, honey. He's Goya. DJ Eddie Cruz. Yes. <laughs> now, um, now, speaking about talent and singing, um, when is your new music coming out? Well, it's coming shortly. It's being produced already by DJ Mike the Wizard. And um, then later on, it's going to be taking place with uh, ben, who's uh, promoted out here at Escuelita also. It's called The Pato Song. For those that don't know what Pato is, Pato is faggot, but in Spanish, my version. Pato here, Pato there. Pato's everywhere. Ooh, fabulous. It should have been great last yesterday. Because there's so many patos yesterday outside. Did you see them? Yeah, so now tell us about um, Gay Pride. What did you do for uh, you know New York City Gay Pride 2009? Honey, this year I stayed, I stayed with my um, closest best friend, my um, uh, significant other, and uh, we just watched the parade from 12 o'clock until 7 o'clock. I never wanted to finish, honey. It was so long. Long. But I had a great time, though. To me, Pride is spending with your family and friends. You know what I mean? your highlights that you really uh, the little the parents P flag a lot of kids this year with their parents and I was like that was touching it was very I don't know it's a different kind of vibe it was like people would criticize the gay community yet you see all these little kids with their parents and then the uh, it was amazing it was just one of those amazing events that you get all the time you know now tell us, uh, we're here in New York City, you know, 40 years ago the Stonewall riots started, now it's 40 years, what are your thoughts on that? Well, to all those people that were caught and arrested, all I have to say thank you, because without them, I wouldn't be here, and none of these people would be here. So thank you, and let's have another 40, 50, 60 more years, okay? I just hope the community can understand and appreciate that what we do, it's a talent to make people laugh. I've always said, I entertain you, but who entertains me? Who are your favorite drag performers, by the way? Who do you enjoy watching? Who would I enjoy watching? Well, first of all, my gay daughter, Claudia Dumont, Harmonica Sunbeam, um, basically, uh, and Victoria Lace. Because they're, they're comedian, female impersonators that they can improvise. And I learn how to improvise if something goes wrong. You know, never let them see you sweat. And I never do. <laughs> and you look fabulous today. Thank you, darling. You would think I arrived like this, do you? Mm. So now uh, tell us, um, where else can people see you perform or do shows or host? On Fridays, I work at this club in uh, Queens, 80th Street in Roosevelt. I don't know if you heard of it. It's called Los Acuerdos. My night is called Sanctuary, which is Latin American for those people that don't actually speak Spanish and they're looking for a club in Jackson Heights that can play their kind of music, Latin house music, not just the same old repetitious songs that every club in the neighborhood plays, you understand? And now here on Monday nights, I kind of like it. It's very, it takes me away from my, my daytime job. I'm in the retail world. Ooh, manager in retail. 
working, honey. You work it every way you can, right? You gotta do what you gotta do. These are desperate times, Rose. So, any uh, últimas palabras para tus fans de habla español? Sí. May you have a good job, another job, and keep working on getting a better job because these are desperate times. Until then, love yourself because you only live once on Liberty Dumont. Mwah. Ooh, shit. Gracias, chica. Oh. Mwah. Mwah. Okay, okay, that was good. Oh. Is this the cocksucker resident? Oh. God damn you, stop calling here. Isn't this 4215 pussy way? You bitch! Now, bitch! Now, bitch! Now, let me check the zip code. 212, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! The police are tracing this call this very minute. Well, Donnie, he go the way I'm Boyfriend in the lips, you taste my octopusy. <laughs>